Here is our first of two Windows 10 tips for Thursday, June 6th. We talked about it in a previous tip that you can actually now resize in Notepad itself. So if something's too small, I can just use my fingers to pinch and move around, making a font larger or smaller. But I can do this for the entire screen. Let's say that I have a browser open and I want to draw somebody's attention to the address that I'm typing in. And maybe the address isn't large enough on a screen within a presentation. I can hit the Windows key and the plus to fire up a program called Magnifier. Magnifier runs as a window. It can be minimized and you can zoom in and out on Windows to make something like the address line very large for your audience. Tip number two comes right from Twitter. Niche 8, Anisha, makes the statement about Windows needs a function, a screenshot function similar to what Apple has. She's not a fan of the snipping tool. Well, this next tip may be something she is not aware of in Windows. The Windows key in print screen you'll notice flashes. And what that flash does automatically for me is under my pictures folder, screenshots, creates a screenshot numerically, I'm up to 48 and puts everything on my screen or multiple screens if I'm using more than one monitor into a graphic file called screenshot with a number. Pretty easy to do. The other thing besides the snipping tool that Windows has introduced is the ability to actually mark up a page within the browser itself. And this is done within Edge. So I could go over and say, thanks for the suggestion and save off that page. as a file, pretty easy to do.